All right, Halos, welcome back. How's everyone doing? It took about 10 minutes or so, uh, including Q time plus uh, Champion Select, but uh, we finally got into a game, so that's good. <laughs> uh, hopefully this one will go pretty well. Looks like we're up against an Aurelia mid with Lethal Tempo from the looks of it, so that's interesting. They have a Gragas Galio bot lane, which is also very interesting. Gragas having, uh, what is it called? Uh, phase Rush, yep. There you go. All right. Well, let's check it out. Looks like this guy does play uh, Aurelia quite a bit. I don't know what levels everyone is. It doesn't really tell you, sadly. But uh, yeah, let's let's get into it. You used to be able to see people's levels. That was like the the main thing that you could see, but evidently not anymore. So I don't know if these guys are like ranked. I don't know if these guys are, uh, you know, they shouldn't be ranked. They really shouldn't be. But you never know. Let's get into game though. Should be, I didn't know how quick it was gonna load in, so I just wanted to start the video a little bit early. Sometimes recently it's been loading like super quick, super fast, uh, super quick, so yeah, we'll see, we'll see. But yeah, looks like the Zed ended up going top lane, possibly. Um, they really does have teleport, which usually the teleport player usually goes bot top lane rather, but um, you never know. Sometimes they switch things up a little bit. All right, let's get in it. Um, let's see. We can go Doran's Blade Start, I think. Probably best to be a little bit on the safe side, just to be sure. Uh, I do kind of, just a little bit, want to play, um, what's it called? I kind of want to play Lethality a little bit here, but I think we'll still start out with the Kraken Slayer and kind of see where we are in that regard. Excuse me, I don't know if you guys heard that. I tried to mute, but I think I accidentally double clicked the mute button. <laughs> My bad. This guy's gonna flash. <clears throat> Alright, well that worked well. That worked real well. A Demacian does not retreat. We'll be a little bit late to lane, but having this extra combat powder is gonna be nice. And it is actually the Aurelia mid. They didn't swap back or anything. My king. <clears throat> oh, nice. We're gonna get all of them. Except the one, obviously, that we missed, but that's not a big deal. Sound the march. Alright, run away buddy, run away. Have fun with that. The warrior spirit is never broken. Alright, looks like he's just gonna sit under his tower, sadly. Kind of unfortunate, but it is what it is. Whoops. Covered the minion's health bar up so I can see it. Okay, I took a second turret shot there somehow. That was interesting. 
There we go. Nice easy kill there. Obviously she's gonna teleport back, but that's fine. Get a nice little recall here. Grab another long sword as well. <clears throat> Obviously we'll lose a couple minions there, but it's it's fine. Oof, RIP. Alright, at least we got some of the XP there. TP'd back to push one wave and then recall, or what? What what happened there? Where'd she go? Yeah, one wave and recall. Okay, interesting. Still sitting under her tower. Sadly. course she has her ability that just you know <clears throat> she can just ignore damage it's always fun Alright. Cool champ. He has 20,000 dashes. Let's get out of here and buy our item. Seven minute Kraken Slayer, that's what I'm talking about. Alright, we're probably going to be focused pretty heavily here though, so we got to be a little bit careful. Still, I think we'll be alright. I do kind of want to go um, a little bit lethality though, so let's see what we got. Well, we might go Collector, we might go Yumu's. Yumu's gives a little bit more, but Collector's just so much better in like every regard almost. Alright, really is gone once again. She's probably going to get plated steel caps, which is fine. Alright, Karthus got his void grubs. At least that means we know where he is. That's good. <clears throat> Alright, Zed's now mid.
Good for you, bro. Good for you. Why are we not finishing off uh, this dragon? I don't know, but I'm getting trolled, so that's always fun. He just starts dragon and doesn't finish it. Also, the dragon is freaking wrecking me for some reason. Why did you start dragon and then just peel off, bro? Screwed me so hard. Now I lose like two minion waves, and it's harder to go up against this Zed. Unless you're coming with me, that would be okay at least. Victory. <clears throat> Hopefully he dies. Please. Please. Oh my god. There's no way you let him live there, bro. And you missed your Q. Once again, getting trolled. But that is how it goes. So that's always fun. The warrior spirit is not a problem. Now I lose like three and a half minion waves on top of everything else. Bye. Somehow I die to a turret shot even though I'm way out of range. But we got the shot down at least, so it's worth. Yeah, we definitely need to take the void grabs, that's for sure. Okay, he missed. There go, at least someone got him. A Demacian does not retreat. Uh, of course he dodges it. Of course he dodges my ultimate with his ultimate. Ah, oh, so cringe. He gets four kills and gets fed top lane, and then they swap. And then I get trolled by my Nautilus on the dragon. And so I'm like half health when I come back to lane to fight him. No one's going to defend my mid turrets, so that's cool. Our support is 1v1ing their jungler. That's fun. <laughs> Okay. 
Okay, he flashed. Zed spot, so kill this turret. Just auto it. Okay, never mind. Nautilus jungle is an interesting pick for sure. Yep, that's what happens when our Teemo feeds him four kills incredibly early. Cloud Drake for them, I guess. Interesting. by my team. And they have a smurf on theirs, which is always fun. More than one, honestly, but we'll just we'll pretend it's one for now because I don't know for sure about the others. And I get trolled by my team again, and we lose because of Surrender Vote. Wow, they really gotta remove this from the game, guys. You can't just auto-surrender at 15 minutes just because you're having a bad game. Oh, wow. This is... I'm getting trolled so hard. How is this fair, right? This is not fair. There's no way this is fair. Okay, well, we still gotta get our first one of the day, so let's go into a bot game. Because this is probably the quickest queue we can possibly get, to be perfectly honest with you. Too bad it's such a waste of time. Oh well, there's not, not much I can do about it, honestly. Like, it's just how Riot made the game. It's unfortunate, but it is what it is. Death is like the wind. Always by my side. Alright, well, let's do a quick bot game to finish it off, the video off, and we'll, uh, we'll also get that first one of the day, of course. I think I'll try to do the, um, the two epic monster takedowns that I need to get for that other, uh, Lunar Revel mission, so we'll try to do that as well. Hopefully it doesn't take too long to get into, to, uh, loading into the game, I mean. But yeah, hope you guys are enjoying so far at least. Uh, unfortunate that I get trolled and inted and then my entire team surrenders. But that's what happens. <laughs> that's League.
Let's continue on. Hopefully we can continue to load in quickly. It does take a minute, but it is what it is. I wish they had Sword of the Occult back in the game, though. That was really nice, just st stack a bunch of AD for free. It's very similar to the uh, Magi Soul Stealer. It's just for AD instead of AP, that's all. All right, well, I'll be right back. I'm gonna put something away in the other room while we wait for it to load in. Oh, never mind. There we go. That's all I had to say. The magic words. All right, let's get into it then. Um, yeah, we will get a long sword. We don't need the um, we don't need the potion so. And we'll get uh, vampiric scepter super early as well. That should help us out. Ravenous Hydra would be pretty good of an idea overall. What do you guys think? I think so. But yeah, we just gotta wait for the minions to spawn in, and then we can start pushing, try to get a lot of damage on this tower if possible. We did remember the demolish this time, so that'll help us and speed things up quite a bit, so that's good. Also, um, I might decide to do it before this video releases. I'll have to see, but um, I'm quite interested in doing the Final Fantasy VII uh, remake uh, playthrough on the channel. I just played through it when it was released, um, I think it was a year ago, or maybe two? Something like that. Um, I just played through it, and it was super fun, a super good game. Um, but the uh, the second one, which is, I think, Final Fantasy VII Rebirth, is coming out. Um, of course, it's only going to be on PlayStation, I'm pretty sure, as an exclusive for about a year or so, just like the first game. So I'll have to wait an extra year to play it on PC, sadly. But um, that's probably going to be what I'll be doing. So yeah, I'll play the, through the first game, and that should take a minute anyways, because it is quite a long game. Uh, extra long for like recording as well. But yeah, that should be what we'll be doing, and then, uh, if you guys are interested at least. But yeah, what I was going to say is just leave a comment if you, uh, if you are interested in that type of thing. And I'll try to, try to do it sooner rather than later. <laughs> Alright, there we go. First turret plate down at least. How long on the demolish cooldown? Uh, where is it? 17 seconds, okay. Let's get out from under this tower. There we go. Very nice. Get another demolish proc off real fast. Two turret plates, it's not too bad. Alright, we did take quite a bit of damage from the minions there, unfortunately, but. It's okay. Never could. It'll be all right. There we 
go. First blood. Let's get second blood as well. And then keep pushing this tower. get a little bit more damage on this tower while we can and then we'll recall for our first item there we go get that demolish proc off and then recall here hopefully the minions won't stop my back I'm gonna try to do a little bit of a cheeky one here uh-oh uh-oh oh man yeah that was not a smart idea I guess I was super close actually to getting the recall off but I just didn't so unlucky wasted a little bit of time there but it's all right Alright, let's TP back, and then let's get Holebreaker. I feel like that would be useful. Especially against the turrets. Haven't played with the new Ravenous Hydra too much. Oh my gosh, I missed. Nice. Alright, nice. That worked well. Still haven't leveled up my W yet, so that's always fun. But yeah, this is kind of the slow going of uh, of leveling up accounts and such. But it is, it do be like that sometimes, you know? Oh, freaking dodged me, what the heck was that, Faker? So yeah, it is going to take a while, um, but we'll get it. Oops, I missed one. There we go. Don't want to draw aggro, so I'm not going to hit him with that tornado. proc off and try to get death this down this turret real quick don't have a ton of attack speed though it's the only problem pushing the tower down it is a little bit slow going though I'll be honest especially with these guys just attacking us constantly
But at least we can survive pretty much forever with uh, with the life steal, so that's always good. Come on, let's push it down. We're almost there. We're almost there. Oh my gosh, we're about to die. That was close. Well, we got it at least. Alright, we'll recall once we get this this uh, inhibitor here. Alright, let's recall and get out of here for a second. You know what, I'm going to get Collector too. We have so much money here. Collector, and then we're going to go... Uh, hmm, what should we go? Let's go more Lethality. Yo, Moose. Yeah, that should work. And let's get it for Zerker Greaves. That's what I'm talking about. Alright, cool. There we go. Well, thank you guys for sticking through it on the last half of this video. But I really appreciate it. And I will catch you guys in the next one. Peace.